ominous warnings of an approaching tornado sounded in Flatwoods, Kentucky today as this menacing funnel swept just west in Lexington. Severe thunderstorms packing violent winds stretched across the south, ripping branches off trees in Tennessee. This is really bad. Downtown Parkersburg, West Virginia this turned into a flood zone history. brought on by heavy afternoon rain. The storm system pushed through the Midwest this weekend with reports of nearly a dozen tornadoes, including one in Christian County, Illinois, shredding roofs and damaging power lines. From California to Texas to Florida, about 100 million are under heat alerts. Omar Villafranca is in Johnson County, Texas. The baking triple digit heat here in North and Central Texas has also turned parts of the state into a tinder box. This wildfire has burned more than 1300 acres. And for crews, working in this heat is dangerous. Parts of godly Texas look like hell on earth. Firefighters are urged to take cooling breaks as needed. They may only be able to work for 15 minutes before they have to go cool off. In Juneau, Alaska, a glacier melt turned the Mendenhall River into raging rapids. There goes, there goes. That ate away at the banks and sent at least two homes crashing into the river. Back here in the Northeast, the wet weather forced the FAA to reroute planes around the storms heading to the East Coast, causing delays in airports, including New York, D.C., and Atlanta. We all have stuff to do tomorrow. Now we can't. So. More than half a million customers are without power across the South and Mid Atlantic, and at least a dozen states are under tornado watches tonight. Meg Oliver, CBS News, Reading, Pennsylvania.